for an exit now. Mega, Ike player, versus PK Chris, uh, Nest player from Long Island. Both these players very, very talented. Um, some of their best players uh, of the character in the state. And that is saying um, a lot, especially for Ike. We have quite a few good Ikes in the year state. And Ness as well. We saw Blitz on stream earlier. Very good Ness. Uh, PK Chris, certainly the best of the Nesses in New York. And Mega at this point, um, certainly uh, establishing himself as one of the best Ikes as well. Um, and we're going to see, in a match that maybe traditionally would be one that you would think Ike is pretty favored in. Ness obviously not having a whole lot of range. Ike having a lot of it. Um, we're going to see how P.A. Chris can adapt. However, so far I've been very good. And I want to say, P.A. Chris probably going to be familiar with this matchup with the Sone experience from Long Island. Uh, meanwhile, uh, I can't be positive that Mega has a whole lot of Ness experience. So we're going to see if that affects it at all. Back to stage. Okay, Ness getting knocked off stage once again. Ike's ledge trap so strong, so deadly. Um, the potential here for stock is definitely... Uh, Possible for Mega. Gonna look for that down tilt? No, looking for that fair. Rolled in by PK Chris and a DI mix up. DI'd in for that fair. Did PK Chris, got up air, down tilt up air, gets the stock for Mega. And a nice uh, start for him after taking a whole lot of damage. Ooh, nice side. We're using that burst option that Ike has. Ooh, nice little reset there by PK Chris with the up air into grab. Gonna be a quick stock. For him to even up this game. Did roll there. Uh, Mega not quite fast enough on the grab. I obviously not too, too fast. Um, ooh, crazy. Almost got the, the spot that was punched there. Was waiting for it. I'm um, going to take some damage, though. Okay, looking for that up air on the platform. Again, Ness does have a really nice amount of combo potential here on a character as large as um, Ike. However, um, now we're seeing uh, Mega do a really solid job of boxing out. Um, PK Chris. Ooh, back to stage. Looking good. Ooh, and we're seeing so, uh, why, like, Mega kind of is establishing himself as this, like, super high level like player. Um, really a, a highly defensive player, willing to back up at almost all costs. Um, and it, it, it is showing some trouble for PK Chris here. Back to stage. Ooh, and Ness not quite getting that angle that was necessary. And Nair into up air is going to be a true combo to death. And Ike is not quite at death percent just yet. Nice, utilizing that up yet a shield. Not a super fast option, but just fast enough to get that punish on Ness, drif on Ness drifting out. Ooh, going to look for detail. Look for Nair. Get some quick uh, extra damage before this stock comes to an end. As Ike, you need to get some damage here. Going to take a back here, though. Offstage, not a great position for Ike to be. We know that all too well. But a nice recovery by Mega getting around. That upbeat from Ness and gonna get back to stage. PK Thunder again, so threatening and gonna be enough to take the stock. Getting around it was Mega trying to do. Um, did not end up doing so though. And PK Curse is able to take the stock. Oh, S Smash trying to maybe even get a two frame there. That move does two frame on the ledge. Um, didn't end up working out for Mega. Ooh, quick uh, F-Tilt, catching the defensive option for PK Chris. What is the ledge option? Ooh, looking for that F, just missed the reaction a little bit there on the ear dogs down to the floor. Looking for maybe a burst option. Dash attack potentially will kill here. That up, he had a shield, will be not quite enough just yet. Ness is super duper light. Ooh, nice stall right there by PK Chris. Gonna be able to get back to stage safely, but we're seeing Mega doing such an excellent job of maintaining stage control. Looking for that roll. Has a, I recognize that PK Chris has rolled in quite a bit. Gets a little bit impatient there. Goes for a dash attack. Ness now has um, Ike in disadvantage. Scary situation for Ike to be. Down tilt. D good DI out by PK Chris. Gets back to stage. That neutral be by Ness. So good. <sighs> Scary situation for both players right there. Barely missing out on the down tilt. That jab coming out as well. Not going to get punished super hard for that. And a dash back. Going to get caught by an Ike dash tag after taking quite a bit of percent. A scary situation for Mega. Going to be able to clutch that out. And is going to be Mega over PK Chris in that game number one. Ooh, yes. Nice catch right there by Mega on the dash back. You saw it. Maybe even reading a roll here. PK Chris a lot of the time went after landing with an, uh, an aerial there like you saw with back air. A lot of the time did roll this time around.
just dash forward. It's the same, it's a, you know, the, the situation covers the same thing, covers dash back, and it also covers rollback. So, regardless of what Mega was reading there, ends up getting the stock, and that's gonna be it for game number one. We're going to FD game number two, I definitely understand this. Um, you wanna limit where I can land, however, Ike certainly has the ability to limit where Ness can land as well with these big meaty hitboxes. Double Nair into the back air, not gonna quite con connect just yet. Um, that is a tight confirm and doing a rising Nair, a quick, or a quick falling Nair after that first one is tough. So, super tough confirm right there that Mega went for. Possible, uh, but still in a good position. Back to stage. Looking for that roll and didn't end up getting it there. However, still got to punish for that down air after down tilt. Ooh, roll in. Was in the middle of that down tilt too. That Ike's down tilt, while pretty fast, it's not super fast, can put Ike in a decent amount of lag. Um, a lot of people get to get back to stage, but similarly, also, um, oh no, that's a missing put. Um, so, even stocks here. <laughs> um, after side being to his death in Mega, and this is going to be a lot of percent. So, does Mega get a little flustered? by uh, the SD after having a decent lead. Um, again, you can't land on that up tilt. Super huge, that hitbox. Nice, grab Ness out of the air. Quick down throw into up air. Gonna be a, a nice 25% added on to Ness. 61% already um, built up onto Ness. And after a, what was a rough start to the second stock, Mega looking pretty good. Looking for that dash back again on dash attack. Wouldn't have killed there obviously, but would have been a great positional advantage for Mega. Oh, we're cooking side B a lot. Okay, Thunder came out, nice parry on the Nair, allows me Chris to get a Nair of his own, but Nair into up air is still a confirm. Yeah, still in the game. PK Chris, a little upset about it, but yeah, Nair up air, very much still in the game. We know that we ner they nerfed that, it's not quite as good as it used to be, but uh, it's still real good. And already a quick 21% from an Aether um, by um, Mega. That new should be looking good for Pete Chris. Does get a, a good positional advantage, but a quick roll by Mega off the ledge does not allow Pete Chris to react with that up air. Quick 66% um, already on to PK Chris. That throw not going to kill just yet. Ike super duper heavy. Back to stage. I think we're going to be looking for an air up air. I think we're, we're, we're nearing that percent. And that was definitely a ledge drop nair or get up attack. Um, so. Uh, unfortunate for Mega, two SDs costing him so far. Um, however, um, still in a great position. 91% already on Tenes. One Nair up air confirmed will absolutely do it. Looking for the back air right there. Look for him landing. And PK Chris just drifts back with an up air. Gonna be able to get out of that situation. Back air really quick. At a full hop height. Oh, looking for a dash tech again, I think, is Mega. Um, those defensive options come out from PK Chris. Yeah, you can see him looking for that same dash attack he got before, and there it is! Dash attack by Ike. Again, crazy good burst option that kills fairly early, um, and it's gonna take it for Mega there. 2-0 over PK Chris. So Mega looking really good so far um, in this bracket. Moving on to winner's top 24. PK Chris, of course, will move into losers now, um, and we will see how far both of these players go later in the bracket. I'm sure both will be coming at you later today in the stream. So we will we'll see how they do. With that said, once again, I am Unel. Follow me on Twitter. Follow House on all their social media. 